Ginger Jester. Alright, let's check out the Project Triangle Strategy debut demo, which is, I guess that's a name you can put on your game, but the game looks really good, so. On the faraway continent of Norzelia, three mighty powers reigned. The Kingdom of Glenbrook, through which runs the mighty Norzelia River, bringing flourishing trade. The Grand Duchy of Esfrost, a land of ice and snow beneath which slumbers rich veins of iron. And in the desert, the holy state of Hyzant, home to the lake from which is harvested the salt essential to life. With each nation controlling one vital resource, conflict between these three powers was all too common. Minor disputes and skirmishes gave rise to fierce battles and before long, the realm was engulfed in a bloody conflict that would rage on for years. Many died in what came to be known as the Salt Iron War. Brought to their limits and facing their mutual demise, the three powers at last negotiated a truce. Peace came to Norzelia, but only briefly. Shortly after assuming power in Esfrost, Archduke Gustadolf launched a surprise invasion of the neighboring kingdom of Glenbrook. The might of the Esfrostian forces, under the command of the formidable General of Lora, easily overwhelmed Glenbrook's crown city. Before any could comprehend the meaning of what was happening, the once proud Whiteholm Castle had fallen. Learning of the attack, House Wolfort, Highest of the three high houses of Glenbrook rushes to the royal family's aid. Leading the charge is none other than young Saranoa, who has only just taken over the mantle of lordship from his father. At his side are Benedict, House Walford's advisor and a veteran of the Salt Iron War, Roland, the younger prince of Glenbrook and Saranoa's childhood friend, and Frederica, his betrothed who hails from the very duchy they now call foe. Oh, that's interesting. A new war is kindling, fanned by the unwavering convictions held by the rulers of these lands. And though they may not yet know it, Saranoa and his comrades are heading straight into the pyre. Esfrost's forces have breached the once proud walls of Whitehall, and now overrun its majestic halls, leaving only death and destruction in their wake. Like bloodthirsty beasts, they search, eager to carry out Archduke Gustadolf's orders to kill any member of the royal family on sight. With the very future of the kingdom hanging in the balance, Saranoa hurries to the throne room as fast as his legs can carry him. Night of Ace Frost Invasion. Do they... Do they mean to hurt us? I think so. They will do no such thing, my princess. Not so long as I draw breath. Cease the vainglorious theatrics. The city is mine now, and not a soul loyal to his grace still lives. You are all that remains. Not even the Dawn Spirit can hope to triumph against such odds. You talk and talk, but do you have the courage to test your words? This is folly, Gustadolf. What madness has possessed you? Is this how you would take revenge for what befell your father? 
Nothing so petty as that, Regna. The war and all its atrocities should remain buried in the past. Then what drives you to commit new ones? To tear down the future we labored so long to achieve? Do you think Hyzant will stand idly by while Glenbrook burns? I gotta see what the profile button is. Okay, so it, it literally gives you a profile of the character. Alright. I shudder to think what ends you hope to achieve by such vile means. Yeah. Cool. <laughs> you always did lack imagination. However, not even I foresaw the opportunity this foolish partnership would afford me. As for Hyzant, she shall meet the same fate as your beloved kingdom before long. Whatever your aims may be, you'll never... Father! Are you hurt? Roland? Brother? You imbecile! Why do you return? Be grateful to see me for once. I wasn't about to leave you to these wolves. You stone-headed brat! If it isn't my dear Frederica and her newly betrothed, and you've brought friends. Stand down at once. On the honor of House Walford, we shall not let the royal family come to harm. So you're the young one. You have courage, if not much sense. I'll give you that. Brother. What is the meaning of this? I am sorry for forcing this unpleasant scene upon you, Frederica. I had to take action. Soon, than anticipated. Action? What do you... Listen well. I, Gustadolf Esfrost, do hereby condemn the King of Glenbrook and his agents for their treacherous deeds. Scheming to claim the riches of the Grand Norzellian Mines their own. They slaughtered my dear cousin Dragan in cold blood. For this most heinous crime, and for shattering the trust between our nations out of malice, I declare their punishment must be swift and final. So this is the lie you would weave. What mummery is this? Dragan was killed by... Silence, my lord. Benedict? I commend you for delivering the traitorous Prince Roland to me. He too must answer for his crimes. Hand him over, and House Wolfort may yet see itself through this unscathed. You are my dear sister's husband to be. Bend the knee, and no harm shall befall you. I will do no such thing. We won't be party to your treachery. Your father was ever a thorn in my side. You seem intent on repeating that history. However, I fear you will not live long enough to accomplish it. General of Laura, kill them all. Yes, my lord. Well, this has been a short game. Stop! I won't let you... Ah! Brother! Ah! Sir Maxwell, leave me! Take Roland to safety! Yes, my lord. My prince, with me. I can't leave them! Step aside, Sir Maxwell! My lord, we must flee at once. But his grace... Roland! Lord Wolfort! There is no saving me. The future of Glenbrook lies in your hands now. Father! My prince, follow us. He didn't... He, he couldn't have been like, take Cordelia with you too, she's just a little girl. But I... Damn it all! After them. You would once again see Norzelia bathed in blood, Gustavo? Truly, you are lost. This land has long been lost, Regna. But it need be no longer. This is where Sir Maxwell would have us wait. He is readying the boat for our escape as we speak. Anna, who? Oh, she's with House Wolford. A wise decision, 
no doubt the river is our only hope of getting out of the city alive. The streets are overrun with as frosty soldiers. Our foe no doubt searches for us on the other side of this very gate. Then we wait here and pray for Sir Maxwell's swift return. Father. Frenny. Or Delia. And what is she doing with us? She's with the enemy! What? No! I, I had no idea! Hmm. Lies! It was your own brother that attacked the city! If I had any idea he was planning such atrocities, I would have stopped him. He's... I know not what's possessed him. My lady speaks the truth. We are as shocked and torn by this turn of events as you. Enough, Hewitt! We can't be clawing at each other's throats with the S. Frosty army looking to hunt us down like dogs. My emotions got the better of me for a moment. Forgive me. Hewitt means no ill, my lady. Her fellow members of the Kingsguard were slain before her eyes. For now, let us focus on the present. Prince Roland's safety and escape are our main concerns. Of course. These are trying times, but we mustn't let emotions cloud our judgment. Benedict, you stopped me from speaking the truth of Dragon's death. To what end? Gustadolf would frame Glenbrook for Lord Jurgan's murder and claim it as pretext for his invasion. If he knew we witnessed the truth, our heads would already be on pikes. It would seem he still intends to put them there. Because you spat in the face of his demands. What we know could expose his claims as the treacherous lies they are. If it came to light that Gustadolf orchestrated his own cousin's murder, no one would dare stand by his side. Indeed, however, words have little substance on their own, especially when weighed against the power and influence the Archduke commands. Your truth would be taken as the pathetic ramblings of a desperate man. Once again, your wisdom makes me feel the fool. No, we are all fumbling through these dark times. You spoke and acted as the Lord of House Wolfort, and did so admirably. And yet my actions have put everyone in danger. Father would have known better. Let us look forward, my lord, not back. There are truths yet cloaked in the shadows. We must survive and see them brought to light. For these truths shall be the weapons by which we lay S. Frost low. Thank you, Benedict. I promise to do all in my power to see us through this safely, every last one of us. I know you will, my lord. Let us await Sir Maxwell's arrival. Sir Maxwell shall prove true to his word. We must be patient. While the game comprises multiple phases, in between story scenes and battle, there will be an exploration phase. In this phase, you may move freely about areas to gather information from the people around you, obtain items for view, mechanisms, and terrain features that may serve you in battle, and more. To end the exploration phase and progress with the story, press the L button. Hmm. Interesting. So I can just chat to people? And I think that's right. Behind these doors, there might be dozens of those bastards just clamoring to take our heads. I guess we have nothing to do till Sir Maxwell comes calling with our boat. Let's open the gate. He's still distraught after witnessing the murder of his entire family. <laughs> what a puss. <clears throat> uh, on his own sister's wedding day. Hmm. So they were supposed to get married today. 
Oh man, we were supposed to bone later. Can, can we still do that? No. Oh. His, his sprite is so detailed. I was just looking at like... He has like this angle and then like... Eh, a little tiny bit more and then... Eh, 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 eh. Well, that's his left. Oh, uh, okay. I thought there was just multiple diagonal sprites. Okay, it's not as detailed as I thought. It's still pretty freaking cool looking. We are the last alive who can keep Prince Rowan safe at a time like this. Oh. Uh, we need your blade. Let us fight together. Well said, my lord. There's hope so long as we still stand and stand together. And so long as you are here to guide us, Lord Wolfort. The boat should arrive soon enough. In the meantime, there's only one thing we can and must do. In Norzelia, three major guiding convictions prevail. Utility, morality, and liberty. This will take the form of invisible parameters influenced by the choices you make throughout the game. These parameters will not be reflected visually. Your decisions will shape Serenoa's convictions, as well as influence which companions may choose to join his cause. Ew. Oh, interesting. Oh, I can move the camera. Oh, neat. That's neat. Can I go down this ladder? Oh, I can. <laughs> Look at that water. That's, uh, that's water. Ooh, I like the light reflection. I obtained 50 unknowns. Why unknowns? From Pokemon. Sweet. I think I, yep, I see another shiny there. Okay. TP recovery pellet. That sounds like it'll be helpful in recovering some TP. Very astute. Observations. Fast forward? Are you f oh! Ah, I can fast forward his little animation of climbing the ladder. Yep. <laughs> Nothing! Is there anything shiny up there? Let's just go. Yep. Oh no! Oh no. Oh no, I clicked on the wrong thing. Large HP recovery pellet. Well, that sounds like it's useful. For recovering HP. <laughs> um, right, there's the other thing. Alright, cool. Menu? What's in the menu? Unit details. Oh, look! Uh, oh. I love the artwork. He really reminds me of, like, Balthier from Final Fantasy XII. Except, like, older. Frederica. I like Frederica. That guy does not look trustworthy. <laughs> Encampment? What is that? Oh! At your camp, you can make ready for battle at your... Encampment. By purchasing items and obtaining... Quietuses? Quietuses. I've never seen that word before. Many additional activities will be possible at camp in the full release version of the game. Well, I would hope. Da -da 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 -da. Trade post? Move an ally's turn to directly after your own. Huh. And it uses the, uh, the Y unknowns. Hmm. Oh? Oh, you're further away than I thought. Okay. Young Smithy. Okay. So you can forge weapons and stuff. Provisions. Pellets. Mm-hmm. 
kind of glad that they don't use uh, food for HP recovery, because that always kind of bothers me, because, like, you get shot by a gun, you eat a chicken leg, it's not going to do anything for you. <laughs> um, provide me with the necessary materials, and I would be honored to temper and repair your weapons. Okay, so you probably can't just outright forge them. Hello? Come to what you whistle or in search of information. Either way, you've come to the right place. Barkeep, ah. Well, this is neat though. Wasn't really expecting that. Okay, I think I've done everything that I can. So, conclude. Yes. Curses. Where's the boat? Ooh, ooh, ooh. Save in progress. Oh no. Um, with their pursuers closing in, Cyrano's retinue puts their faith in Sir Maxwell, who has made arrangements for an escape boat. My prince, I'm sorry to have kept you waiting. I've managed to procure a boat for our escape. It should arrive anon. Thank you so, Maxwell. Would that I could have done more. You did well to stand against Gustadolf. Your father would have been proud to see it. Let's save the pleasantries until we're through the gate, huh? Everyone ready? We are. Open the gates, Eridor! Whatever you say, my lord. Here's hoping we can make it through without those bastards on the shore noticing. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Not likely. Over there! <laughs> uh, there's too many of them. We need to turn back. Give it up! There's nowhere to run! Damn it! They've shut us in! Is this it? If this is where I fall, I'm taking these S Frosty bastards with me! Don't be so quick to throw your life away, my prince. Yes, we haven't lost hope yet. The boat will arrive shortly. We only need to fend them off until then. Can we do that? I fail to see why not. If you lend us your sword, that is. As if I would do aught else. Form around the prince. Protect him. The prince is on the bridge! Seize him! Oh, good. They pour from the castle like rats. I shall defend the rear. Alright, two keys to victory in battle in this game are positioning and initiative. Positioning and terrain can be used to your advantage. Attacks from behind your foe or from high ground will deal greater damage. The order in which units take action is determined by their speed attribute. Coming, upcoming turn order is displayed via an indicator at the bottom of the battle screen. Keep a careful eye on turn order and re review your allies' abilities when deciding how to deploy and advance your units. Two keys to victory in battle are the things that I just talked about. Mm hmm. Uh. Hmm. You've got a sword, spear, dagger. He's. What's he got? Equipment cane sword, okay. She's got a book. He's got a book. Okay, so they are organized properly. You're mounted on a bird? Excuse me? She's got a bow. Interesting. He's got a shield. He's only got a shield? He's only got a shield. Okay. Uh, yeah. Let's do that.
The gate to the drawbridge is shut tight. We must find a way to open it, and quickly. There should be a mechanism nearby. Leave our pursuers to me. Open the gate, whatever it takes. Mm hmm. If you also run close to ensure safe passage. Pull the lever to open the gate and reach the drawbridge. To open the gate, move a unit to a square adjacent to the lever. Yeah, I uh, kind of figured that. Break through the gate and capture the drawbridge to make your escape before the enemy surrounds you. You're just saying the same thing over and over. <laughs> like, come on. <laughs> Removing a friendly unit, some squares will be colored purple. This means that the square is within enemy attack range. Aha! If an enemy is able to attack a friendly unit next turn, a red line connecting them will appear. Take care to move vulnerable units out of harm's way. I will end this. Okay, and I... Hmm, yeah, it's determined by their speed, so... I, I currently am playing Fire Emblem, which that game just does like your army's turn and you can just pick whoever to move in whatever order you want. Um, so that's a little different. Hmm. Become invisible for two turns. Okay. Do it. Still. Act again? What do you mean act again? Uh. Uh. No. <laughs> Select an additional command. Iron dagger. Um, oh, end turn. There we go. I was like, how do I not do anything else? My turn. But the controls were up at the top left. Um, Roland, Spear Knight, on horseback. What's the horse's name? I must know. That is neat. That is a really neat addition. To this kind of setup, little aggro lines can't help but be reminded of the Final Fantasy twelve that does that. This All right. is ours. Not yet, it isn't? But I like your enthusiasm. Can't move there. So, oh, that guy. Hmm. So she should have range, right? So if I move her here. Oh. So her. Oops. Uh. The bow only has a range of one, two, three, four. That's not very much. Um, I think I'm just gonna leave her there for now. Cause I mean, she's a an archer, right? So she should not be able to take hits. So. I don't want her up front. There is no mercy on the battlefield. Uh, and he's got a cane spear thing. So, that's cool. Move him up here. Raise an ally's physical defense and magic defense for three turns. That sounds pretty good. Use it on Roland. Ready for more. Yeah. Forward. All right, now Mr. Main Character Man, get you up here during this fight. Oh, he's got a delay attack, like Titus in Final Fantasy X. 
I mean, anyone in Final Fantasy X can learn it, but it's it's like Titus's thing. I'm gonna regret that, aren't I? I'm gonna get stabbed in the back now. On my honor as the Dawn Spear. Uh, oh, Maxwell's just standing there. <laughs> I shall do what I can. Well, what is that? She's got a rod. Oh, she's a healer, and she can cast haste. Ooh. I like the sound of that. Um, let's get you up behind that guy. Haste. Why can't she use it? Let's see if I can figure out why she can't use it. Oh, it's got two diamonds, and she only has one diamond. So I guess you build up a diamond every turn or something? That would be the logical thing. So I guess I'll move her here and say end turn. Uh, I might though. You don't know. Deal physical damage. So it falls to me. Right. He's got the ice spell. He can use on this guy. Huh? Got a range? Hold up. Ah. Create an obstacle on a target square that extends one square on both sides. The obstacle will disappear over time. It's an obstacle? It doesn't cause damage? Oh, uh, I was kind of expecting to press the button and like get more information or like confirm, but he, he kind of just went for it. Um, Tone Flames. Okay. Flame Shield. Grant him the ability to counterattack. Hold on. Flame Shield. Oh, and now I'm picking the target. Okay, yep. Yeah. I don't know why that confused me so much. Ready for more. Iron dagger. On this guy. A steel. Sound strike. Another. Oh. Turn that way. No. Oh. Huh. Hmm. He's kind of stuck there, isn't he? Double thrust. I don't really need to use double thrust. Yeah, I can just stab him. Alright. Um. Here I come. Alright. Get over there. Do a physical damage to a single enemy. Oh. Ah, uh, yeah, she can fly, so she probably ignores terrain and height and stuff. Let us I don't know for sure, but that would make sense. Yeah, okay, so he can use this two diamond ability now, because he has two diamonds. Raise an ally strength and magic attack for three turns. Nah. I'm just gonna stab this guy. Okay. Okay. Punk. Just as I planned. On my honor as the dawn speed. You're an open book. Well. Defeat is not an option. Uh 
How do you feel about this? It feels pretty good. I get it. She's she's ice stuff. <laughs> haste. Yes, use haste on the guy that I've buffed. Can't really do much. <laughs> um, excuse me. A pursuing party has emerged from the castle. Maxwell. Now, before more arrive, I'll take you on. Maxwell, you're supposed to be stopping those from showing up. Um, whose turn is it? Erador. All right, so I can flank this guy. Oop. Uh, knock him back. Five squares! That's quite a bit, but not gonna do that right now. Gonna go up, pop! Hurts, don't it? I struck true. Wow, that was not very strong. <laughs> Starting to think he might just be a support character, because he's got all the support things. Even though he's armed with a uh, sword, technically. And bang, and then the other guy should follow up. And finish him off? No. Alright. I... Oh. Oh, neat. You have a little display that shows everyone's health and stuff. And... Do you know? Oh. Meat. All right. Um. Da 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 da. Iron dagger on you. And Shimona. For life. Yay. Where was I? I don't know. Where was you? Hmm. Maybe this can. uh you know, inconvenience those guys back there. My turn. Uh -huh. Alright, so... That guy is, uh... Gonna die. Pretty much on his own. Double thrust on Mr. Shieldy Man. Okay. Time to take flight. Bow on that guy. Finish him all. Finish him. Fatality. Fallen enemies will drop loot. Move an ally to a panel containing a bag of loot to claim it. Loot will be added to your inventory after the conclusion of battle if you triumph over your foe. I fight for peace. I fight for my friends. Uh, intern. Okay, so Maxwell is engaging those. Careless of Let us <laughs> out their weakness. Oh, careless of me. Our victory is assured. Ha 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 ha. On my honor as the dawn speaks. Hmm. Uh oh, Maxwell. That's it. Maxwell, he's flanked. Oh no. 
Now he's surrounded. Defeat is not an option. Defeat smells like boots. Uh, that's not what I want to do. I want to do this. Get my, mm. Can I just longsword him? Yeah, I can. Bonk. Exploding weaknesses. When choosing an action, an icon will appear over any enemy units that are particularly susceptible to it. Attacks from behind are guaranteed to score a critical hit. If an ally is positioned behind an enemy, you strike with a physical attack. That ally will automatically follow up with an attack of their own. Yes, I have learned that. Um, can I go up here? Yeah. Yeah, I sure can. Hey, buddy. You're not gonna like this. Do, 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 do. How did he get the horse up over the ladder? See that? I shirk from no danger. Funk. Yes. <laughs> He's just like, well, shit. Your orders. Uh, do, 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 do. take cover. Oh, what? I what? I did not press the home button. Why did that happen? Uh yeah, just just end turn. I don't know why she keeps getting two turns. This battle is ours. Uh yeah, pretty much. Oh wait, um Oh, can I get the guy up there? No. Not in range. Ooh, that's that's a pretty powerful attack. Let's try that out. Fellow swoop. Yaw. Victory is ours. I shall do what I can. Gonna be honest, that wasn't as uh, strong as I expected it to be. Cure wounds on you. There you go. Yay. Jesus, I forgot this guy existed. Feels like forever since, uh... He had a turn. He used Provoke on that guy. I didn't read the description, but Provoke usually means that they will target him. To work. Um, can I read the description? Ability detail. Provoke all enemies within range for two turns, drawing their attacks to you. Hmm, weird. Because I, uh, I targeted him specifically. Oh, right, this is a, the ice wall guy. Like, uh, I don't really know what to do with him. Can I, can I attack with the tome? <laughs> Cost two damage. I don't know, just, just sit here or something. Uh, Lance. Base. Well. Oh. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> On my honor as the dawn. Okay. Okay. Wow. Wow. So. No mercy on the um. You can open the gate. It's fine. The gate is open. Yeah. It's open. Go. Um, enemy reinforcements. Good. Don't let them escape. Capture the royal family. Kill any others who stand in your way. Great. Protect the prince. No matter how many come, our blades will keep them at bay. They've overrun the bridge already. Very well. We cut our way through. Quietuses do not use up a turn. It can be triggered instantaneously. A single quietus can be used only once in a given battle. I don't know what a quietus is supposed to be. I will end this. Uh Oh 
Jeez. Uh. Okay, maybe not. <laughs> We'll move her up, but like, can't go set anybody on fire. <laughs> Hot dive? Damage that will increase proportionally if you launch the attack from higher ground. Hmm. Well, can't really do that right now. Impossible. I wonder if this game has permadeath. Probably not being a tactical game. Rather than like a... It's more like Final Fantasy Tactics than it is like Fire Emblem. Hmm. Hmm. Not very strong. Hmm. Well. Better than nothing. Spank. Oh, he's asleep now. That's why it's called Slumber Stab. Cool. The hunt is on. So if I attack him now, will that wake him up? This battle is won. Leave it to me. Oh well. <laughs> oh, he's still alive. How unfortunate. Hmm. For victory. All right. Um. Let's get you up here. Double. Oh. Rush. No. Double thrust is stronger. Move four squares in a straight line, dealing physical damage to any enemies in three squares along the way. Oh. So, he will move in that direction. Bam! He's got his, uh, his stuff buffed, so I'll send him up all on his own like that. Hmm. Shall we begin? Um... Your wounds on yourself. You won't beat me. I see a path to victory. All right, this guy is the one who's going to finish this dude off. All right. Now time. My knowledge grows deeper. Time for some research. I will end this. <sighs> Act again. No thanks. <laughs> For the honor of House is she just able to move twice? Is that... Or is, like, taking cover? Become invisible for two turns. Effect will be lost if you attack or stand directly in front of a foe. Act twice. Passive skill grants two actions during a single turn. Ah. There we go. So yeah, she has a passive skill where she can act twice. That's pretty neat. Um, so that can kill him. That can almost kill him. That can not almost kill him. Hawk dive it is. Hawk dive. It's bar. For my kith and kin. Oh, impossible! I fight for peace. Scorch. All right, lady. Let's see what you can do. Not 
much. Hmm, but there's no MP. So, that's neat. Uh, one, two, three, four. Blinding. Bonk. The winds of change are blowing. Hewitt learned shadow stitching arrow. Hmm. That sounds like um shadow bind. I think it was called. Where you pin someone's shadow to the ground so that they can't move. Oh no, more of them. Let's see. Shadow Stitching Arrow. Deal physical damage to an enemy and have a chance to immobilize them for two turns. Yep. Alright, so it's your turn, right? Yeah, okay. Um. Get you here. And Shabak. I must hold firm. That went well. I <laughs> shall try my level best. Your level best? That'll do. Hmm. She can't reach anybody, so just gonna hang out there. Uh, this healer lady. Can you... You can! Fast forward. I'll take you on. Provoke! So, it falls to me. Ice guy. Ice damage! Aha! He does have a spell. How did I not notice that sooner? Bing! Yeah, everyone's fighting Maxwell. From where shall we strike? Should be able to finish well with just this. Yeah, there we go. Spank. Time to take flight. Alright. Getting close. Never mind. Can't use fell swoop. Um. Well, you. Ha 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 ha! Impossible. <laughs> Impossible. What happens if Maxwell dies? <laughs> Come on, man. Alright. This won't be easy. Double thruster. Did you see that? Onward and upward. Turn push back. Death must wait. Uh-huh. Are only a shield. Yeah. Try right, out my new shadow stitching arrow. Like trap. Haha. Uh -huh. Defeat is not an option. Wait. Oh, oh, Maxwell. Impossible. My spear grows heavy. Keep the prince. Uh, uh. Um, that doesn't seem good. 
Did he just, like, permanently die? The tides are turning. Knowledge is strength. Circle of healing. I've been waiting for this. Sounds like an AoE. Grant HP to all allies within range. Mm hmm. Okay, so they should be focused on him now. This won't be easy. <laughs> here instead and finish this guy off bang yes die already <laughs> time to work uh iron dagger number stab not as strong okay it's kind of what I thought but I figured I'd check Ah ha ha, so she can attack twice, right. This Neat. Surmount. I don't know what that does. Surmount. Move to an adjacent square with a height difference within 15 units. Oh, so she can basically just teleport. <laughs> That's pretty cool. Wow, it seems like forever since you had a turn, lady. Finish that guy off, would you? Victory! But at what cost? Maxwell. Hey, I got 80 Y unknowns. Swell. Oh, I guess he's alive. Boat arrives. Come with speed. Prince Roland, will you leave your brother unavenged? Yeah. You! Go! Leave this place! The Archduke will be content with your father's head. Never. S. Frost will answer for its crimes today. Your Highness! A shame. You might have lived a long life. So long as I stand, you'll do him no harm. Sir Maxwell! My prince, you are responsible for more than just your own life now. You are a leader, and must be the beacon others look to when the night is darkest. My friends of House Wolfort, I leave Prince Roland in your care. Let me go! Release him to me, and there may be mercy for you yet, Maxwell. Whoops! Tis you who should be seeking mercy. Must you do this? Very well. what they can do when the stakes are so trifling. Very similar to something Ned Stark said in Game of Thrones. I could not have said it better myself.
Wow. <laughs> That's pretty cool. How do you still stand? With my legs. You were this realm's fiercest warrior, Dawn Spear. But today your sun sets, and a new age begins. Hmm. So he's not confirmed dead, and he was wearing a mask and a hat, so he's gonna show up later. And you're supposedly not gonna know who it is. That's kinda cool though. And so it was that the once proud kingdom of Glenbrook did fall. Esfrost seized control of the Crown City, threatening to bring the surrounding domains under its iron yoke. Now the Archduke's army marches upon House Walford's stronghold, where Prince Roland is being sheltered by his loyal friends and allies. Oh, jeez louise, this keeps going. Wow. Alright, well, uh, that is all the time I have for this right now, though, because I really need to get to bed. I was only planning on playing this for like a half hour, but I, it, it, it just wasn't enough time. Um, so yeah, uh, links in the description if you want to check this demo out yourself. Maybe even play the next part that I'm not playing. Um, is there more to it? Yes. It looks like there is another chapter. Okay. So yeah. Um cool. I'm I'm really impressed. I'm really looking forward to this now. <laughs>